instead of the controversial 996, the 997 was shown at the 2004 Frankfurt Motor Show. As you understand, it was the next generation of the Porsche 911, a dream car. However, only a few had the opportunity to implement it. Even people without financial problems do not always have the fortitude to purchase this car. The 911 is a car with character. This will not fit everyone. He needs to match. After the premiere, versions began to appear. GT3, GT3 RS, Turbo GT2 and GT2 RS. It's easy to get lost in them. Until now, many do not know how, for example, Modification 4 differs from 4S, or Carrera from Turbo. And when it turns out that all this confusion of abbreviations is largely true for the convertible and partly for the target body, you want to forget about Porsche forever. However, take your time. This is a true sports car without compromise. And its quality is worthy of the title of a dream car. Just think, today there are exactly 22 versions in the 911 line. Take a look at the site, make sure for the sake of sports interest. Among the power units, only gasoline boxer engines of 3.6, 3.8 and 4.0 liters were used. The power scale varies for different versions from 325 to 620 horses. Atmospheric engines, with one turbine, with two. Porsche supercharging is considered the most efficient. There are no turbos here, and the faster you go, the more efficient the engine starts to work. Transmissions are good too. Six mortar mechanics out of competition, there is even an automatic. But the PDK robotic box with two clutches is still considered the fastest. And in terms of reliability, by the way, not a miss at all. Speaking about the standard automotive values, the reliability of the mechanical part, electronics, corrosion resistance, on all counts of the 911th, you can safely put fives. Galvanization of the body does not allow it to rust, and the sporty margin of safety of engines and transmissions with regular maintenance, and if you do not participate in races and drag battles, will allow you to roll back up to 250,000 kilometers and even more without major repairs. There are problems on the electrical side. For example, the multimedia head unit is buggy, it goes out or does not return discs. But in the context of the cost of the car, these costs are small. There are isolated cases of cylinder damage. However, the problem affected a small number of Porsche 911s. Nevertheless, quite often it is necessary to change the failed ignition coils and the drive belt tensioner of mounted units along with the pulley. What should you pay attention to when choosing a car? First of all, on the condition of the clutch and drive shafts. The previous owner, How to Drink, bought the 911 not in order to take a child to school in it in the morning. The steering tips and rods do not differ in strength, although in the context, again, all this is nothing. The main thing is to carefully examine the engine and transmission for leaks, especially around the RMS main axis, rear crankshaft oil seal. In addition, there are leaks through the oil cooler, weakening, and problems with the cooling system cracking pipes and failure of the pump. It will not be superfluous to get into the cylinders with an endoscope to check their mirror surface. Nuances happen. When inspecting the car on a lift, pay attention to the condition of the silent blocks of the rear suspension. Since the engine is at the rear, it is this part of the chassis that is subject to faster wear. Well, the mandatory control of the condition of the springs and shock absorbers. In general, looking at the Porsche 911, many simply lose their heads. Whereas the choice of such a machine requires a cold mind and attentiveness. Otherwise, you can step on a time bomb that will quickly empty any wallet. Electrician. Burning low speed resistors on cooling fans are considered a congenital disease. It is easy to check, the air conditioner is turned on, and if the resistors are intact, the left and right fans turn on at low speed. If the fans are standing, replacement resistors. Transmission. The six-speed manual transmission is considered the most resourceful. However, in terms of performance, there is no equal to the seven-speed robot PDK. We recommend the machine to those who are deprived of the ambitions of a super racer. By the way, the all-wheel drive system, if necessary, is able to transfer 100% of the moment to the front wheels. Engine. The weakest point of the Porsche engine is the intermediate bearing of the IMS shaft. Its destruction can cause serious damage. However, unlike its predecessor, the problem is not so large-scale and has not affected many. Symptoms, uneven engine operation and metal filings on the oil filter. 